A woman wants an investigation into the fire that killed an elderly relative. And Latoya is live in South Dallas in that neighborhood to explain what happened. Well, Tim and Lauren, the Dallas Fire and Rescue Team is just back out here because the home is still smoking. Apparently a hot spot has flared up, and so they're on scene trying to figure that out. Now, sadly, as you mentioned, someone lost his life here. Um, he has now been identified as 74-year-old James Humphrey Jr. I just talked to his cousin who lives next door, and she says that it's okay for us to release his name at this time. Now, this fire broke out last night around 1030 in the 4000 block of Spring Avenue. Firefighters say when they arrived, flames were shooting from the windows in the front of the house. More than a dozen firefighters worked together to get the fire out, and they did it very quickly, too, but it was too late to save the man inside. When I pulled up, the house was in flames. My husband was jumping the fence. My son was jumping the fence. And I broke to run to go to the gate, and my son and my husband cut me off and wouldn't let me go into the house. And I kept saying, could they get him out? Can they get him out? By that time, nobody was allowed to go in the house. Now, according to relative 74-year-old James Humphrey Jr. had mobility issues that may have actually prevented him from trying to escape himself. The cause of the fire is still under investigation, but crews are looking at into whether or not this was an electrical issue. In fact, relatives believe that his electrical meter may be to blame because it had been here only for a short time, and they said there have been problems with it in the past in this neighborhood. Now, we did contact Encore for their reaction to that, and they say that it is under investigation. Reporting live from South Dallas, I'm Latoya Silman for Good Day.